Hey everyone, this is Sang Helios, and this is three things to do in the Plains of Eidolon. Let's go. Okay, so counting down from three, um, we're gonna start off with number three and then eventually get to number one. So this is number three, explore the caves and stuff around the map. Now this is really cool because all the caves are different and you'll never find two caves that look the same. I think there's about 13 caves in total. There's an achievement for going in all the caves. Some of them are hidden in missions, you have to open them in missions and stuff. So it's a really cool system, and uh, once you find a cave entrance, it'll be marked on your map, like this one, and the one up top. So this was in my previous video. So you can find the caves, you can go inside, you take out your nose and cutter, you'll, you'll see on the left there. Um, there's typically a lot of gems in, the, in, the, in these caves. So yeah, it's a good place to come if you want crystals and stuff, and you can come inside, and there's resources and all the rest of it. Alright, so this is one cave, and I'll go show you another one, and then we'll move on. Alright, the cave is just here. There it is. So I wanted to record the entrance of this one because it has a really cool entrance. Instead of just walking the side like the other one, this one you have to drop down this big hole. And uh, there's also a ledge where you can um, where you can stand halfway down. I thought it was another level. So basically I'll land on that and show you that. So here we go. Let's try to get on this one. There we go. Okay, so there's the second sort of level where you can drop down. There's nothing really here, there's some there's some gems you can get them but they're random spawns. And then you drop into this water down here and it will drain your energy so be careful of that. Here's uh, an example of the, the gems I was talking about. They're very common in these caves. So yeah, you drop down here and you can't get back out. There's another gem. There's another one. <laughs> so yeah, they're really common. Uh, some more water and then you turn left. Go over here. And then you can go around this bit in the middle. Nothing really here, it's just cool. The water drains your energy, it's really annoying. And then here we are at the, the exit or the other entrance. And then you just come out and it's kinda kinda hidden in the rocks there. So um yeah that was that one. And then just go back to the entrance again. Here it is. There's another jump. So yeah, this one's kinda cool if you want to come to it, it's here on the map kind of in the corner and this one is a drop down one okay so let's go to number two now all right number two visit the zip wire it is here on the map in the far right corner in the grenier camp um next to those two caves i just showed you and this is really cool because it's a down downwards um zip wire or zip line and basically that means you can slide down the whole thing and it's really long as you can see it goes from that tower to this post right here and it has like a platform to get onto it and stuff and it's quite cool because there's a camp down there and there's this this turret right here that shoots missiles at you it's kind of epic <laughs> like that and then this this camp right here will be full of grenier as well so basically just hop on the zip wire and slide down it's pretty cool and if you come here at sunset the sun will rise right over there so it's pretty pretty cool and yeah it's a cool cool thing to do a cool place to come to so if you're bored or something and come here, come here and check this out. There's two turrets and they constantly fire missiles at you. So I guess it's kind of a game to, to dodge the missiles. So there's six missiles in the air right there. You can take these turrets out, but it's more fun without them. Oh, come on. So yeah, you can stand on this and take out the tower. Or the, the camp down there. Jackets down and let them die. Yeah, they shoot at you. This camp up here will shoot at you. I killed them because I had to get on it. This turret, that turret, it's pretty hectic, but I mean, if you kill everything in this area and come here at a sunset, like I said, the sun rises just up there, and it, it makes for a pretty cool screenshot. I have a screenshot of that. So yeah, if you're if you bothered about screenshots, then come do this. So yeah, that was the zip wire. Now moving on to a less less hectic uh, number one spot. All right, see you then. All right, and taking the number one spot, I think that number one deserves. Climbing one of these shield generators, as you can see here, these big things that put the shield up around the planes. So, the reason this is number one is because I feel like a lot of people would do this as soon as they come in. Because it's, it's quite obvious, like, climbing one of these. But to, um, to some other people, it seems like a waste of time. So I'm pretty sure you can do this on every single one, it doesn't matter which one you go to. As you can see, they're all, all lined up along here. And, um, yeah. 
So basically I'm gonna climb this now and I'll see you at the top. Okay, so I'm about at the top, one control jump left, two up. Ah, there we go. So you can stand this rusty metal bit in the end. And block out across the planes, the missiles over there, all this stuff. Uh, the gates are down there. So you can do this on any one. I think I think this one is the tallest one I've seen yet. That one that one looks a little bit taller actually. But this is this is the one I, I always go on. I don't know, I like it. Um, shoot off some freeze blasts and stuff. I like to meditate up here. It's pretty calm. Pretty cool. And I feel like everyone should do this at least once. Take a nice screenshot. Why not? Alright, so. Thank you for watching, guys. That was three things to do in the Plains of Eidolon. When you're bored. When you just want to have fun. I don't know. Whatever you want to do. Alright, I hope you enjoyed watching. And uh, this has been Sang Helios. And I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.